In today's video, you will learn how to clean a Miller valve. For today's video, you will need the following items. A strap wrench, channel lock pliers, muriatic acid, a scrub pad, and chemical resistant rubber gloves. Step one, shut down and isolate the system for maintenance. Step two, loosen the unions on the flow meter and remove the flow meter from the chlorinator body. Step three, spin the top 90 degree elbow off of the Miller valve threads. Step four, remove the top half of the chlorinator and then remove the cotter pin and float arm from the Miller valve. Step five, Spin the Miller valve counterclockwise to remove it from the chlorinator. Step six, in a bucket or pail, mix a solution of acidic water by combining four parts water and one part acid. Always pour acid into water, never pour the water into acid. Step seven, remove the plunger from the valve and put the valve and its components into the acidic solution. Step eight, wearing rubber gloves, remove the valve and components from the solution and scrub as necessary with the scrub pad. Be sure to gently scrub the bore where the plunger goes. Step nine, rinse the valve with fresh water and check the bore for roughness or damage with your finger. Step 10, reassemble in reverse, making sure to wrap threaded parts with Teflon tape to avoid leaks. Step 11, Turn on the unit and check for leaks. For more how-to videos, or to buy replacement parts for your chlorinator, visit pureaquaproducts.com.